So really you are persecuted. You have some war in your life. You have poverty in your life. But then where is your hope? Who are you waiting to come and deliver you from this problem? That's all. Let us read from the book of Romans. Yesu, Once you confess Jesus mbwana, that he is the Lord na mwako, and believe in your heart wafu, that the Lord raised him from the dead kuokoka, utaoko, you ka. will be saved. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And he is not a respect of persons. Read for us from the book of Romans 10 chapter, chapter 10 verse 9. Kwa sababu ukimkiri Yesu kwa kinywa chako ya kuwa ni Bwana na kuamini moyoni mwako ya kuwa Mungu alimfufua katika wafu utaokoka That if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus and shalt believe in thine heart that God raised him from the dead thou shalt be saved Ukimkiri Yesu ya kuwa ni Bwana once you confess that Jesus is the na Lord na kuamini moyoni mwako kwamba Bwana Mungu alimfufua katika wafu and believe in your heart that the Lord raised him from the dead taokoka you will be saved Sida iko the problem is there lakini wewe ni Yesu ndio ni kubwa but then you are not seeing the problem to be so big you are seeing Jesus to be the Lord kwa alimfufua Lazarus kutoka kaburini if we raise Lazarus from the dead ni siku ya ine. on the fourth day hata ameoza if he was thinking hata ananuka he was thinking tena akamuita Lazarus toka and again he called him Lazarus come out na akatoka and he came out sasa umuone Yesu ni bwana so you see Jesus to be the Lord by remembering what he did to you na wengine, and what he did to others yako si kitu. that you may see that your problem is nothing yesu ni buwana, that you see Jesus to be the Lord muone anaweza, you see that he is able hallelujah, hallelujah. Atafanya kitu then he will do something in your life amen amen Ndugu mmoja usiku amepiga simu one wa brother called me at night about 12 midnight this is you know wapi huko I don't know from where. Because he was looking for the number of the servant of God. Then he said, let me call the brothers of faith. He said, my son here is coughing. And breathing through difficulties. Amen. Amen. So we are requesting you brothers to pray for us. So we are praying on behalf of the servant of God. So I said, okay, close your eyes. We prayed. And we slept. I don't know whether it was 12 midnight or what. 
asubui, when I woke up in the morning, at 7 o'clock, he was calling again. Saying, I'm thanking the God of the founder mother. After the prayer, the child goes some sleep. And he slept, and now he has woken up safely in the name of Jesus Christ. So he chose the way Jesus Christ. And see, so in singing that he might more than the problem the child had. And he made him to be his hope. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So he has the power to go here and there. But then he chose Jesus Christ. So salvation came. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So the greatest thing inategemea. depends on your faith. Where is your faith? Lako liko wa. What is, where is your hope? Lako liko wa. Where is your hope? Mungu God is not a respect of persons. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. It doesn't matter how old you Dali are. Kanisa. Inside the church. For 50 years, 40 years, the thing that works is your faith. You see Jesus to be the Lord to your problem. And you see him to be able. If we did to that, and he did to that, Lazarus, one, Lazarus was decaying on the fourth day. And again, the blood began running again. And the flesh became fresh. And life came in. So you see that the problem your child has is nothing. And the problem I have that is nothing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. To see him to be the Lord, <laughs> then he will do something. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You read for us again. Kwa sababu, Ukimkiri Yesu kwa kinywa chako ya kuwa ni Bwana na kuamini moyoni mwako ya kuwa Mungu alimfufua katika wafu utaokoka That if thou shalt confess with thy mouth the Lord Jesus and thou shalt believe in thine heart that God hath raised him from the dead thou shalt be saved Hallelujah Hallelujah so once you confess Jesus to be the Lord and to believe in your heart that the God raised him from the dead you will be saved. You will be saved. So why not get saved? And you are confessing Jesus to be the Lord. I was suffering asthma. But then I was confessing Jesus to be the Lord. I had so many problems in my body. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But then I'm saying with the Lord, if we resurrected Lazarus from the grave, it was on the fourth day, he was stinking. So what is my stink? What is my rod? What is asthma? What is tuberculosis? What is poverty? A person who is dead, on the fourth day, people now despair. But then he brought back the guy, and he's the same yesterday. And today, and forever and ever, so I believe he'll do. He will also give back my life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. So I worked on that faith. God has, is not a respect of persons. 